Orca, also known as killer whales are found throughout the world's oceans, while there are a few places such as Antarctica, Norway, and Alaska where they are most abundant. Orcas are the largest members of the dolphin family. Males are bigger than females, but they vary in size and weight, depending on the type of orca. The largest orca I ever recorded was a staggering 32 feet long and weighed 22,000 pounds. That's about 10,000 kilograms. So why the name killer whale? The ancient sailors around the world used to observe large whales get killed by a group of fish with relative ease, so they were given the name whale killers, which through time, eventually flipped to the killer whale. Orcas are famous around the world due to many factors, firstly, they are present in every single ocean, and due to their distinct black and white pattern, are easily recognizable. Orcas are also highly intelligent and are known to use hunting tactics. Killer whales are notorious for playing with their prey. They flip dolphins out of the water, toss sea lions in the air, and even gang up to wash seals off iceberg. While seemingly playful, this is actually a strategic hunting tactic. The way orcas sleep is also very interesting, they do not sleep like humans or most of the other creatures of this planet. Humans continue to breathe while we are unconscious. This is not the case with orcas. They cannot breathe unconsciously and have to remain awake and conscious to breathe, and because of this, orca have developed a special type of sleeping called unihemispheric sleep. In this, orcas only allow one half of their brains to sleep at a time, the other half stays alert enabling them to continue breathing whilst looking out for dangers in the environment. They even only close one eye when they sleep. For example, the left eye will be closed when the right half of the brain sleeps, and same for the other half when the right eye is closed. Orcas periodically alternate which side is sleeping, so that they can get the rest they need without ever losing consciousness. As if they get into a deep sleep, they might suffocate, and while sleeping, orcas swim very slowly and steadily, closer to the surface. Orca live in hunt in family pods of up to 40 members. So, to form hunting tactics, orcas must need to communicate. Orca families are pretty intelligent. And in orca populations, knowledge is passed down to younger individuals from their elders, including what and what not to eat, and where to find it. Orcas communicate through vocalizations and calls unique to pods, and family groups, even the accent of such sounds changes with the population. Having multiple prey items to choose from probably led to the specializations we see today, millions of years ago, different groups started eating different things to avoid competing for the same food. Scientists now recognize several kinds of orcas called ecotypes. They hunt specific prey and live in different parts of the world. Now these groups are genetically different, in addition to their unique appearance and cultures. It is estimated that there are around 50,000 killer whales globally. And in the recent decades, some of the species have declined and are even considered endangered. Orcas worldwide face a number of threats. They get caught in fishing nets and gear accidentally, face problems with toxic waste and pollution in the sea. Increase in boat traffic can result in collisions with orcas. In some regions like Greenland, Japan, Indonesia, and some Caribbean islands are still victims of whaling effort. Historically, populations in the Pacific Northwest and North Atlantic are targeted for live captures to be sold worldwide. Orcas in the Pacific waters off Russia, are still captured and sold into captivity. Do like and subscribe, if you learned any new fact from us today, and tell us your favorite killer whale fact. And as always, thanks for watching.